Hi everyone, this is Dave, and what I've got here is a new TV from LG. This is their 43UJ67, also known as the 43UJ670V as well. And you can get very similar specification models from LG with very small differences between the particular model numbers. This particular one sports four HDMI inputs. Uh, which is quite a big differentiating factor from some of the other models of similar price. But the reason I wanted to share this video with you is because these come in at such an amazing price. It shows how prices of 4K or UHD televisions have dropped over the past six months. In fact, at the time of doing this video, you can pick up a 43-inch 4K UHD HDR TV with the LG branding for between £360 and £400 in the UK, which absolutely blows my mind at how uh, the prices have dropped so quickly for such a high quality panel. So let's take a closer look around the back, then I want to talk to you about WebOS and also some of the great smart features that are built into this particular television. You certainly won't be disappointed with the selection of inputs around the back. We've got USB input 1 just here, then we've got the first two HDMI inputs. Then we've also got the antenna for cable TV and satellite in. And then we've got some component uh, audio and video inputs as well. HDMI input three and four, another USB, Ethernet, and digital optical audio out. Now, if you didn't want to connect this to Ethernet, you can actually use the built-in Wi-Fi. So we've taken a look at the plethora of inputs around the back of this particular TV. Now let's concentrate on the front. The image quality is fantastic. And the actual user interface served up by WebOS is extremely good too. We've got these tiles at the bottom where we can access various smart features. We've also got access to the settings at the top here. So we can actually uh, go up to here and we can change the audio, the inputs and go into the main settings. If we go into the main settings, they're very nicely set out. We can change the picture modes, aspect ratio, sound, and then we can also go down and access all settings. And the all settings panel is actually overlaid on top of whatever you're watching. So again, you can change the various aspects of the sound and picture whilst you're watching something via either Smart TV or on one of the inputs. As well as the various catch-up services, we have of course got Amazon Prime Video, and this serves up both regular HD content and also a selection of UHD content as well. I think overall, you'll be more than happy with the audio output from the built-in speakers, but more so, you'll be very impressed by the jaw-dropping UHD HDR content served up by this particular television. So as you can probably gather from my review, I'm very, very impressed, not only by the features, but also by both the sound and the video quality, and more so, the price point for £399, which was the price of this at the time of doing this video, it just absolutely amazes me. If you're in the market for a mid-size 4K UHD HDR capable television, then I can highly recommend this. Thanks very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please do hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in another one very soon.